hey if you are new here this is Chandan and you are watching the learning field okay so in this video we are going to discuss a very important concept based on OD okay or from OD okay so in the recent years uh, from CSI net point of view and this is a uh, concept is very important for autonomous system of dynamical system that is uh, this is from OD section so in this video we are going to discuss two such very important concept which is brain diction criterion and uh, the point gear point gear brain diction theorem okay so let us first <coughs> going to discuss the brain diction criteria and in the recent years the trend of the questions of the csr net in the section ordinary differential equation there are some questions which are directly based on this type of uh, concept which is the which is uh, from the autonomous dynamical system okay so the uh, theorem is brain diction criteria i am also discussing here some examples of csr net problem also so for that purpose first we are going to discuss the brain diction criteria and then we comes to the point gear brain diction theorem okay so the brain diction criteria says that uh, this is a theorem let a uh, let a second order autonomous dynamical system be defined this is the dynamical system second order autonomous dynamical system x dot equal to f1 x1 x2 and x2 dot equal to f2 uh, x2 x1 and x2 this is suppose one the dynamical system let d be a simply connected domain in r2 such that uh, divergence of a this is equal to del f1 plus del f1 del x1 plus del f2 del x2 this is equal to 2 is not identically 0 over any subdomain d and does not does not change its sign over d under its condition under this condition these are the conditions these conditions uh, then d does not contain any non-trivial periodic solution of 1 that is there is no closed trajectories inside D. This is the clear cut Ben Dixon theorem. Okay. So now we are going to discuss a problem which is comes in December 2019 of CSI net. And <coughs> so let's take an example from CSI net purpose. Okay. So from CSI net, let us take an example. The example is uh, first a minute. The example is uh, from December 2019. Okay. So Consider the system of ordinary differential equation. You can see the dx dt. This is equal to 4 x cube y square minus x to the power 5 into y to the power 4 and dy dt. This is equal to x to the power 4 y to the power 5 plus 2 x square y cube. And then for this system, there exists what? So this question is directly based on what the Ben Dixon criteria. Okay. So if we take this is suppose f1 uh, x and y take uh, and this is suppose f2 x and y. So first we have to check whether the divergence of f that is d by f this is equal to divergence of f this is equal to del f1 and del x plus del f2 and del y we have to find this okay so del f1 del x this is equal to i think uh, uh, 12 x square y square minus 5 x to the power 4 y to the power 4 plus what uh, uh, del f1 this means 5 x to the power 4 y to the power 4 plus y cube means uh, 6 x square y square okay so this is the term okay so this term vanish and this is equal to 18 i think uh, x square y square okay so this is <coughs> x 18 x square y square okay and this is not equal to 0 for x not equal to 0 and y not equal to 0 okay so the bendixon criteria says that this uh, if this term is never vanish then what this has no periodic non-trivial periodic solution that is this has no closed trajectories okay so here four options says that uh, and these are the continuous obviously a and g it is says that the option one says that a closed path in x y uh, belongs to r2 and these are from r2 this is a clearly a autonomous system second order autonomous uh, dynamical system okay so a closed path in uh, this option A says that, option B says that a closed path in this 
and uh, option 3 says that a closed path in this and option D says that it is not a closed path in R2. Okay. So, Bendixon criteria gives the sufficient condition for the non-existence of closed path or the closed trajectory. Okay. So, from Bendixon criteria, it is obvious that the answer will be the fourth option that is there is no closed path in R2. Okay. There is no closed path in R2. The option 4 is correct here. Okay. Now, let us come to the Poincare Bendixon theorem. Okay. So, uh, from in the based on this theorem, okay. Uh, abhi tak to koi question sesa net me nahi pucha gaya hai. Okay. So, let's study this. This is an important, okay. Very important theorem. Uh, possibly, uh, in sesa net exam, there is some questions regarding this theorem or, or based on this theorem. Okay. Uh, we have only to uh, see or only to read the theorems. If there is any questions or there is any questions comes in sets and net from this type or from based on this theorem, the question asks directly from the theorem. Okay. So, the theorem says that suppose that <coughs> R is a closed bounded subset of the plane that is the phase plane. Okay. Uh, point 2 x dot equal to fx. These are the vectors. Okay. Uh, vectors x dot equal to fx is a continuously differentiable vector field on an open set containing R. Okay. The third condition is R does not contain any fixed point. Okay. Uh, then there exists and number four is uh, there exists a trajectory uh, C that is confined in R is the sense that it starts in R, stays in R for all future time. Okay. This is suppose the picture. Then the Poincare Bendixon theorem says that these are the assumptions and the then the part is either C closed C is a closed orbit or it spirals towards this closed orbit as t tends to infinity. That is in either case that is in both case uh, in for these two case R contains a closed orbit. Okay. So, this is the Poincare Bendixon theorem. Okay. Now, uh, there is an another thing that is uh, if we check for a problem, these three conditions are very easy to check. Okay, but the conditions four, it is not easy to check the condition four. Okay, so to check whether uh, a trajectory C that is confined or not in R, that is in the region, in the given region, we have to <coughs> the standard trick is to uh, so or this as on this uh, option of four or condition four, there is the standard trick to construct a trapping region R that is a closed connected set that is the vector field points if the vector field points inured everywhere on the boundary of R then we say that this uh, there exists a trajectory confined in R that is the trajectory is confined in R if we say that or if we can also arrange that there is no fixed point in the region R then from the point care Bendixon theorem we can directly say that R contains a closed orbit. Okay. So, this is the point care Bendixon theorem and uh, up to 2022 there is no question based on this theorem. Okay. But I again say that this is a very important question because uh, in the recent years the trending of the questions from uh, CSI and NET are through a uh, different angle. Okay. So, so, for that purpose this is a very important theorem. Okay. For the new questions which are comes in CSI and NET at ODE section. Okay. So, this is the uh, content for this uh, video. Okay. So, if you like the content, then please give a like to this video, share it with your friends and subscribe the channel. Okay. So, thank you friends. Jai Hind.